How to add a robot voiceover to video, just like this. My cat likes to pretend she had a busy work week. In this video, I'm gonna show you how you can easily make this happen with Veed's online video editor. You can start editing for free by clicking on the first link in the description. Now we're in Veed's editor and I wanna upload my video. I'm gonna click on upload a file, select the video and click on open. After a moment, the video is imported and we can start adding robotic voices or text-to-speech. To add a robotic voiceover, all you need to do is head over to audio in the left menu. Then you should be able to find the text-to-speech button we're gonna click on it and then a text-to-speech interface opens in which you can choose the language a voice and add your text you can choose between a lot of languages and accents however in this case i'm gonna keep it to english us next you can choose the robotic voice or the text-to-speech voice i'm gonna open the menu and as you can see there are a lot of voices you can choose from if you want to listen to what a specific voice sounds like simply click on the play button on the right the quick brown fox jumps over the lazy dog okay let's listen to monica the quick brown fox jumps over the lazy dog. Nice, okay, so I'm gonna select her, I'm gonna click on it. Next, we're gonna add some text in the text box. You can type something in there or paste something. In this case, I'm gonna type something about my cat. And if you wanna listen to what the sentence sounds like with the character you chose, simply click on preview. My cat likes to pretend she had a busy work week. Once you're satisfied and you wanna add it to your project, you can simply click on the button add to project. Now, if you take a look at the bottom timeline, you can see the text-to-speech layer I just added. So let's play back the video. My cat likes to pretend she had a busy work week. <laughs> All right, to add multiple robotic voiceovers, again, we're gonna repeat the steps. We're gonna head over to audio, click on text-to-speech. You can keep everything the same if you wanna keep the same character and accent. You can simply just replace the text. I'm gonna paste something in there and I'm gonna click on add to project. And as you can see in the bottom timeline, the second layer is added. I can play back the video. Unless you count licking yourself and begging for food as a full-time job. Nice, so you can click and drag this layer around if you like. You can trim it if you prefer by clicking on the sides. It's very easy to edit. Now I'm gonna click and drag this back to back to the other one. I'm gonna make this a little bit shorter and there you go. And just so you know, you can add as many robotic voiceovers as you like. So next we're gonna do something cool. We're gonna turn these text-to-speech fragments into visual text. To make this happen, head over to text in the left menu. You can choose one of the presets, but you can also choose a default text style. Now, as you can see in the video canvas, the text is added. And on the left, you will see the edit text menu. You can easily add some text in the text box, but you can also change the font, the size, the color, background color. You can even add an animation, whatever you prefer. In the video canvas, Canvas, you can easily click and drag your text around. You can resize it from here. You can rotate it. And in the bottom timeline menu, where you can see the text layer, you can click and drag the sides to extend and shorten the timing. And in this case, I wanna make it synced with the text-to-speech fragments. And to copy and paste a specific text style, you can right-click on the layer, you can click on copy, right-click again in the menu and click on paste. Now we're gonna do the same for the rest of the texts. All right, so everything is added. Let's play back the video. My cat likes to pretend she had a busy work week. Unless you count licking yourself and begging for food as a full-time job, she'd be employee of the month. All right, so now the robotic voices are added, the text is added, now I wanna export my video. So to make this happen, head over to the export button in the right top corner, choose your preferred render settings, and click on export video. And once the video is rendered, you can easily host and share your videos on Veed if you create an account, or you can easily download the video to your device by clicking on the download button, clicking on download mp4, and then it should be in your downloads folder. So that's how you easily add robotic voiceovers to your video. I hope this video was helpful. Have a nice day and good luck.